How's it going everybody? Welcome to this Fake 069 YouTube channel and today we're going to talk about your iPhone 6 and 6s Plus is overheating a lot after installing the iOS 15. Now we have been using the iPhone 6s and 6s Plus for quite a long time now and also we experienced the same problem and also people are saying especially when they're taught to play the games try to record videos and try to talk over their phone this says their iPhone is actually hitting a lot therefore in today's video we have rounded up the best possible troubleshooting process that you guys can follow right now to solve the problem now if you want to solve the problem there are very minor things that we want to mention first and later we will go through some advanced troubleshooting process now first thing first go ahead and tap your settings and please come down to your display go ahead and tap on there and scroll down here and take a look at your auto lock now if your iphone 6s and 6s plus is always on display then automatically your iphone will start heating up so make sure to tap over here and then choose between one minute or two minutes depending on how long you basically want your iphone 6s and 6s plus to be turned on and now just go ahead and just do your own work and your problem will be solved now these are the minor things that you guys can do the next things you simply can do just go ahead and open up your settings and scroll down to your general now inside of your general settings scroll down here and tap on background app rephrase okay now here as you guys can see each and every time your iphone 6 and 6s plus keep refreshing your background so like if that happens like frequently and every time well there will be a chance your iphone is going to overheat so you can tap simply here and then you can simply turn it off and then your problem will be solved now these are the things that you guys can simply do to solve your problem but if this doesn't help you to solve your problem then go ahead and check out the next one. The next thing so we're going to talk about your application itself. Now, if you have installed too many unnecessary applications that you barely use them, then we will recommend you to just uninstall this application out of your device to solve the problem. Or else, you can tap your settings and you can scroll down to your general, then you can scroll down to your iPhone storage. Now, here, if you don't want to uninstall the application out of your device, then you can take a look. Now first, if you see the application is available here, tap on there, and now you can just tap on offloaded apps, tap uploaded apps, wait a bit, and right afterward, now go ahead and tap on reinstall from here, and then what's going to happen, your iPhone is going to remove all those cache and cookies that application might have. Now sometimes, the faulty cache and cookies can cause the overheating issues on your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus. Doing that process will help you to solve your problem. Now afterward, if you see still you got the same problem, your iPhone is hitting, and you want to know what else you can do to solve the problem. Now the next thing we're going to talk about is your storage itself. So if your storage is uh, less than a 1 gigabyte on your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus, then overheating issue can happen because, you know, because of the low storage, your iPhone cannot run every single program properly. Then all you can do, you can tap your settings, and scroll down here, tap general, and then scroll down here and tap your iPhone storage. On your iPhone storage, you'll be able to know how many things you have available on your devices here. You can delete applications, documentations, or anything in water to free up your storage. Now, after doing that, now let's talk about the browser. So a lot of people often complain that when they try to, you know, use their browser, they say after, you know, browsing a couple of times, their iPhone is getting actually a lot of hot. Well, now to solve that problem, the first things you have to make sure is the VPN. VPN sometimes causes the overheating issues. So you can tap your settings and scroll down to your general and then scroll down again and go to your VPN and device management. If you see your device is connected to the VPN, go ahead and tap on there and turn it off. Doing that will help you a lot, especially if your iPhone is getting hot while you're browsing your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus. Well, even after doing that, let's say you are still having the same problem. The next things we recommend you to check is the update, okay? Now, if you tap your settings and scroll down to your general one more times and tap software updates. Now, if it is happening because of the faulty update, then Apple will give you another new update, which will help you to solve your operating issues on your iPhone with iOS 15, okay? Now, after updating your iPhone, most of the problem should be solved but it's still if you're still experiencing the same problem this is one last things that we recommend you to turn off which is called that reduce emotion now if you tap your settings 
and scroll down here and just open up your accessibility. From here, just go ahead and tap your motion. And from here, go ahead and turn up the reduce motion option or features from your iPhone to solve your problem. All right, guys, so these are the process or the things that you can do on your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus to solve your overheating issues. And this is how you can do it. Hope you find this video useful. If so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you later.